Hello gorgeous people. First of all, I would like to thank Marion Denton for reading her section. May I introduce myself? My name is Raya and I work as an immunologist at Imperial College London. An immunologist is someone who works in immunology. And what is immunology? Well, it is the study of the immune system and the immune system is that special army that each and every one of us have it inside their bodies to keep them healthy and combat all sorts of germs. So I'm going to read my part to you. The hippopotamus. Species name hippopotamus amphibious. The common hippopotamus is one of two living hippopotamus species. The other is the pygmy hippopotamus, Chiropsis libriensis, and both species are native to Africa. Though the word hippopotamus means river horse, hippos are more closely related to dolphins and whales. Hippos are probably best known for their immense size. Males can be as large as 4,500 kilograms and their aggression. Hippos are considered one of the deadliest animals on the planet. If threatened, they can attack using a combination of their huge body size, large canines and surprising speed. On land, hippos can run up to 30 kilometers per hour. Woo. Hippos are primarily herbivores, though recent evidence suggests that they may eat meat more often than originally believed, including other hippos, though what this does to their farts is uh, currently unknown. Like the camel, the hippopotamus is a pseudo-ruminant. It has a three-chambered stomach which lacks the rumen compartment, and thus they do not regurgitate and re-ingest the cud. And they fart, often loudly. To mark its territory, the hippo will defecate while rapidly flaying its tail back and forth, which spreads the feces. When defecation is accompanied by bouts of flatulence, this behavior can be especially amusing or alarming to onlookers. That's my part done, and I pass you on now to Dr. Simone Cuff. Stay safe and strong, everybody.